one of the main functions of our brain that we do instinctively is we try and fit in. Now, I, when I thought about that, I thought back to my time at high school. I don't know if any of you guys remember, but Doc Martens, like, they were all the rage when I was at high school. I seriously just wanted a pair of Doc Martens. Like, because all the cool kids had Doc Martens. And all the cool kids had puffer jackets. And I thought, when I get an Adidas puffer jacket and Doc Martens, I'm going to fit in, everyone's going to like me. What I started to understand was that human psychology is all about our desire, our underlying desire to fit in. Now, the reason being, you go back 2,000 years ago when we were, in, we were tribal, right? If you got kicked out of the tribe, what did that mean for, the, for you? What's that? Death. Almost certain death. Because the chances of you being able to hunt, gather, shelter, look after yourself, you know, it's a safety numbers thing, right? So we all try and fit in. Now, the thing is, is that knowing that, I started to understand why it was that I'd done, my behaviours were driven to do what I'd done for such a long period of time. Now, the thing is, right, uh, do we still live in tribes? We do. We have lots of tribes. We have a work tribe, we have a home tribe, we have our friends tribe, we have all these different tribes, right? The thing is, is that do we need to fit in with a tribe to survive? So stop it. How many of you are just doing what you're doing to fit in with the social norm? That was me. I was just trying to do what I did to fit in. The biggest change in me came from understanding that I was just trying to fit in and stopping it. 